the Cord MA30 metronome is simple. To start, simply just turn on the on-off button. The B tap button, the top one, allows you to set anything from zero, which is no B accent, and all the way up to seven beats per measure. And what it does is that it will play a high pitch click for beat one and a lower pitch for all the other beats. In addition to beats per measure, they also include several articulations including eighth notes, triplets, and sixteenth notes, which at a slower tempo you can actually hear. <laughs> This definitely comes in handy as you move into more difficult music. You can change the tempo by pressing the up or down buttons, and you can move in intervals of 20 by holding a button down. The metronome has a range in tempo from 40 beats per minute at the lowest, all the way down to 200 at its highest. You can also press the B tap button to tap out your own tempo. Press it twice and you get the tap tempo screen comes up. Then use the tap in button to set your tempo. The sound note cabaret button will play a pitch off the bat, generally an A, and it starts off in calibrate mode, which lets you change the pitch. The most commonly used uh, frequency is 440, so we'll just leave it on that. Pressing the sound button again will take you to the note side, where you can change the note. This pitch pipe makes it easy to tune your instrument. You can actually hear and listen to what your A should sound like. The mute button, like I, which I've been using this whole time, does exactly as promised. It mutes the unit. You can also use the volume here. To change the volume. The earphone jack located on the side here makes it simple. If you wanted to just simply uh, plug in and pipe the beat into your ear, maybe to save some roommates, or just because your instrument's too darn loud and you can't hear the metronome, that's a good tool to use as well. So there you have it. It's very simple. That's how to use the metronome. Once again, all you need to do is turn it on, press tempo, and you're playing away.